for the ski round one. We found the smallest whiskey bar on earth. Guinness Book World Record. Continue. Go back to cabin. It's tortoise ski day one, and I'm out here in the dark running by myself with the moon. We have an early morning start today, so getting after it early for the new year in bib number one. Time for a morning jog, which I do every morning before the race. Just a good way to get out, get awake, and listen to some good tunes. <laughs> Come on, Stage one is done, sprint day. I'm hanging out with this wheel of cheese. Um, I gotta ski a little faster to get some of this cheese. And here we have the best Wi Fi seat spot in the entire hotel. It's day three. We have a 325 start, which is super late, so I'm out here, morning jog, and it looks like we have a bit of a cloud, like I'm in a cloud, freezing fog, I don't know, but it's very white around. Oh. Here we go, day three. This is how Jessie gets ready for her race. <laughs> bye bye, Jessie. Getting ready for race day. Jessie's giving me the power braids. Absolutely gorgeous. The braid wizard. <laughs> How to pass many hours before a race. Commuting to the venue on our first off day, and it is beautiful day in Toba. You see, I, I look too old. Stage four is done. <coughs> you know what? You give it your all in the race when you <coughs> throw up mid-race and then give yourself an asthma attack. So yay for stage four. But actually, big step in the right direction. Literally turned myself inside out and told myself, you must make haste, which is from Jesse and I's Netflix show that we've been thoroughly enjoying. So words of wisdom, you must make haste. Yeah. Woo! It's snack time since we have a late race and my go-to favorite all the way. It is a untapped maple syrup, salted cocoa. It's like hot cocoa on the trail. Mm -hmm. So I found this wonderful surprise on my suit this morning. It's my puke from yesterday's race. I puked in the race. Ew! Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> um, so now I'm gonna wash it because it's right before the race and I have puke on my suit. So here we go. That's <laughs> bad. What stage is this? Is it stage five? five? Stage five! Hey, 
it's the rest day before the last two stages. We're in Val di Fiemme, Italy. And I'm wearing this mask thing to protect my lungs since they've been having a bit of a hard time. So I warm up the air a little bit, but it is a beautiful day. Oh my God. This is the racetrack for the last stage where you ski down the valley and then up an alpine climb. So I'm just scoping it out and enjoying the sunshine. <laughs> <laughs> this is what we do for the 330 start dance movies. Step up, baby. Oh, yes. <laughs> Jesse is leading me astray on a dark, <laughs> dark night. Where are we going? Into the darkness. Like a bulldozer, USA. I'm mountain biking. Oh, God. Haley's resting. It's moody time. Moody time. Here we go. Oh. The secret to being fast. Oh, <laughs> Ready for today? Yeah. Last one, last one. You ready to climb up the Alpine Mountain? Hopefully, you ready? <laughs> Hell yeah. Jesse, cheers. We finished the first tour. I'm super excited. It's been a lifelong goal of mine to finish the tour to ski. I've watched it so many years on TV, so I'm super, super excited. Um, I hope you enjoyed this random vlog I just threw together of some snapshots behind the scenes um, to what it's like off the ski trail too and how it is rooming with Jessie. And of course, super excited that she won. Really inspiring to be rooming with her and I'm a lucky girl. 